Good morning guys. Welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Vlogtober Day 6 or 7. I can't even remember what today is. Uh, I think it's day 6. <laughs> uh, I had to go get my cord so I can edit. So I can transfer my files to my computer so I can edit. Laundry's going in the back room. I'm washing the curtains from in here because I was looking at them and I was like, oh, you know what, I don't think I've washed these since I've washed them. <laughs> That's uh, one of my bad habits is never washing curtains. Because <laughs> I forget, you know, they're just hanging there and you forget. Anyways, I'm up here. And, uh, hey, Juniper. <laughs> Juniper, that's holy. So I thought I'd open this. Oh, it's day seven. <laughs> there you go, that answers my question. I can't remember anything. So there's on there. Ooh, it's a bat. I love bats. And then my scrap ball. Get a mummy on it. Wash is probably loud, but I can't help it. <laughs> my apartment's small. Alright, we got like a pretty like purple. It look it's purple. Purpley, lilac-y color. <laughs> and, whoop, very great. Throw on every six lips and a tits pop. I have one fingernail painted, and it's painted horribly <laughs> because I was trying. I bought this new nail polish, and I was wondering what color it was. I can't paint my whole hands that color until Devin's off work because it hurt. <laughs> Because this is a fast dry, it, uh, you know, have to set forever on dry, and then you have to do top coat and all that crap. So uh, I gotta wait till the day that he's off work to paint my fingernails. But I got like a like a neon green color. I thought it was glow in the dark, but I think it was in a display with other ones that were glow in the dark. Because this one doesn't say that it's glow in the dark, but the other ones did. So I just got misled. <laughs> but it's, it was only two dollars. It is uh, LA colors. Color glaze gel, but it no UV is needed, so it says. But I don't like regular nail polish because it takes so long to dry, and you can easily chip it. You know, just touching your nail to anything will mess up the paint job unless you leave it for hours and then top coat it. <laughs> That's why I like the Sally Henson Insta Dry because it uh, dries instantly, pretty much. But they don't have a lot of colors uh, available in that like fun colors but anyways that is my scrap all for today so i'm gonna go ahead and hop off here because the lo lo ugh, washer is being loud <laughs> well i was trying to record me putting the curtains up and i accidentally turned my phone off <laughs> but anyways they're clean now and i'm putting them on the rod I'm trying to i'm just falling back off again that's the bottom So yeah, I had to restart my phone. <laughs> I'm going to hang these curtains up and then i got to record a video for today that's not a vlog. It says he's trying to escape. Are you trying to escape? I hear you messing with the door. Why are you sitting sideways? I don't know, I'll help you. Let me get the rest of these loops on there. I washed my curtains because I noticed that more of them had stuff on it, but it didn't come off, so I guess it's a stain. I can't, I've bought these curtains forever ago from the thrift store. I can't remember if it was there when I bought them. <clears throat> or if it's gotten on there since. I'm not too worried about it because it's just a curtain. Alright. Can you set up the right way, please? Because you are going to get hurt sitting right there. There you go. Oh, it's already darker in here. I like it. Oop, I'm just filming my stomach. <laughs> Whoop, you're sideways. Okay. Yeah, see, I'm not the best vlogger. <laughs> All right. I think I liked it better without the curtains. But I don't like people being able to see it at night, so. I don't know. Maybe we'll, just, we'll leave them open for now so that the sunlight come in. There we go, I got my curtains. <laughs> so I've got to film a video. Whoa, what are you doing there? Damn, dizzy. Oh. I have 
forgot to record a sh well, I don't have to, but I'm going to record <laughs> a shout out video. I was going to do 30 uh, spooky questions today, but I don't think I have time to sit and answer 30 questions with June. <laughs> I have to wait and do that today that uh, Devin is off so that I can record it all in one setting and I have to edit it a million times. So, but today is uh, Spirit Podcast or Spirit Week favorite color. So I'm wearing a pink shirt and pink leggings and I have a pink scrunchie. <laughs> for my wrist because I've been trying to wear my hair down more because what's the point of growing it out if I'm just going to wear it in a ponytail all the time and it's what I keep telling Devin so I've been trying to wear it down and enjoy it <laughs> and Sissy doesn't pull on it as much as Jesse did when he was a baby hey leave that blind alone leave that blind alone I'm going to break it <laughs> but um so yeah, I'm going to try to do some sewing today when Devin wakes up. Because again, June won't let me. She's a thinker. She needs all my attention. Don't she? It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> You're cute. You're cute. Alright, anyways. I also got to get Jesse's school stuff ready for when he wakes up. What is today? Today is Thursday. Oh yeah, we don't have any extra thing to do today. I have special things on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And Friday that we do for school. Um, and there's, I don't have anything for Thursday yet. I need to think of something to do for Thursday. Um, Friday, tomorrow, we're going to do the pumpkin uh, science thing. It's like a, um, you know, like hypothesize what's, if it's going to float or not, and how many seeds are inside, stuff like that, you know, it's just to get their little brains working. <laughs> okay, so it's going to be a short day. Ooh, okay. Let's see, do I need to print anything? Yes, I need to print this, and I need to open this. We are doing one curriculum this year. We've tried it, I uh, mean, it's our first year. And plus, I'm adding other things in that I bought separately. <clears throat> but I'm not liking the curriculum we're using this year. We're going to go ahead and use it. Um, but next time I'm going to try different. What are you doing? We're going to try different um, brand. And it is so hard to find homeschool curriculum that doesn't have religion in it. And I don't want his school and religion stuff mixed together. Because it's two separate parts of life. You know, you don't need to mix everything together. Um, so it's really hard to find homeschool curriculum that isn't Christian based <clears throat> uh, I guess because or, or like weird and earthy <laughs> like like that seems to be the two main groups of homeschoolers is Christians <laughs> and like earthy weird people who live no, no offense to earthy real people but you know what I mean like people who live um, in vans and stuff <laughs> and that's not us we're just regular people we just I just don't want religion mixed in with his school <clears throat> his math is pretty easy today he is really good at math. He's above his levels in math. Miss Ma'am, are you trying to escape your high chair? Because I'm going to have to start strapping you in it. Yes. Why don't you come over here with me? Here. Come over here with me so I can keep an eye on you. Yeah. Anyways, so he's, he's really above in his math and... Uh, he's doing really, really good in the reading. I mean, he can read really well. He just doesn't enjoy it, which is perfectly fine because it's like me. I know how to read. I can read well. I just don't enjoy it. It's not like it's something I enjoy doing. I don't sit around and read. There's a million other things I would rather do uh, than sit around and read. And I think he's the same way. He just wants to get up and play and do stuff that involves moving around. He doesn't want to sit and read books to me. <laughs> or, and he hates writing. Um, I think it's, again, it's because he wants to get up and move around. You know, he's, he's six and a half. <laughs> he doesn't want to sit and write things, does he? No kid wants to do that. That's not fun. I think that's why he likes math more, because we usually get up and move around when we do math. <clears throat> There's a lot of, like, jumping and stuff in math, <laughs> the way we do it. And uh, science and all that is always, like, real hands-on. So I think that's why he likes those two things more. Today we got to do... Uh, language arts, reading, and math, and we're going to do some physical education, 
And I gotta print one thing and one thing he can just read off of the computer. Yeah. I got those two loads of laundry done yesterday, but the towels are put up, but the clothes are just still hanging there. I gotta put them away. Uh, curtains are clean now. I cleaned the door too. I don't know if y'all seen it in the videos, but it was really black. That is Devin's fault because his hands from work and he always uh, touches the doorknobs, obviously, coming in and out. But it's nice and clean. I don't know if you can tell, but I wiped down the window sills. Oh, here's my finger. These thingies. And I wiped down the whole door because it was just dirty for me you know, people opening it and closing it. I don't, honestly, I have no idea when the last time I cleaned that was. Uh, and then I also there's a piece of, piece of wall behind y'all that I wiped down. Good job. Um, that had some scuffs just you know from where the shoes or the clothes rack just things scuffing it up. So I, I got a magic eraser out when I was wiping the door down and wiped that off too. And it looks nice. It looks good. I wiped the baseboard down. It looks decent. I really probably should do that to all the baseboards that are visible. Who cares about the ones that are hidden? Right? I still need to clean the bathroom. I never get in there and do that yesterday. I really need to do that because it, it needs it bad. I just... Ma'am. I just haven't um, wanted to. <laughs> so, that's just me being realistic. You know, sometimes you just don't want to do stuff. You playing with my finger now? I know, I got to paint the rest of them. I have to repaint that one. Yeah. You're not eating it? She got her... Um, it's her front bottom right side too. The whole top of it is out. And the left one you can feel it under the gum. So it's coming. But yeah. I saw a time chat for a minute. But I'm going to record. I'm going to do a shout out video. I already got the people I want to shout out. I need to get their links. So I put them in the description. And then I. What do I need to do? What do I need to do sissy? I need to clean the bathroom. I don't know. I need to put you and your walker in the hallway. And go clean the bathroom. So maybe I'll do that. I want to. If I could afford it, I told Devin, if I could afford it, I would pay someone to come in like once a month and deep clean the apartment. Like, I, I see videos where people do that as a gift, and that would be like the best gift ever. <laughs> I tell Devin that, I'm like, if you ever want to buy me a gift, buy me someone to come in and deep clean the apartment. <laughs> because I hate doing it. I do. Like the daily stuff, but like these, de like the door, you know, it took me forever to get around to just wiping the door. It looks so much better too. It looks like it's been painted. And it's not been painted, it's just been cleaned. <laughs> And when we first moved here, and it was just me and Jesse when he was little, her size and a little bit bigger, I did everything. But we also didn't have all this stuff. You know, when we first moved in the apartment, we moved from a one bedroom, like we were in one room. We didn't have a kitchen or nothing. We just were in one room to this apartment. So we didn't have stuff everywhere. But it's been five and a half years. So we've accumulated a lot of stuff. So it's harder to clean everything um, and move stuff around. And it's just. I also don't have the energy because I have a six and a half year old and a baby now. <laughs> I am a lot older now than I was when we first moved in. So I just don't have the energy, you know. When we first moved in here, Jesse would get babysat, at, babysat every Friday. His grandparents would come pick him up and they'd keep him until Saturday sometime. So Friday was my cleaning day. I would uh, get everything done after he left. And now I, I don't do that. I need to do that. Usually, though, when Devin is off work, we have, like, usually the last day he's off work, we have, like, a power hour, and we run around and we clean everything, but, um, I need to deep clean some things to just perk up the apartment, make it seem nicer, huh? I wish I could wash the walls. I don't know how to do that, though. They're just scuffy. You know, we've lived here for five years, and it wasn't painted when we moved in because we needed an apartment really bad, and we, they asked us, like, we would have had to wait for them to paint it and it to dry before we could move in and they said or you can move in without it painted and so we said okay we'll just move in without it painted so it's not only our scuffs from the last five and a half years but it's the people who lived here before us scuffs <laughs> and you know like nail holes and stuff which I don't mind I cover most of them up with things hanging on the wall but <clears throat> I don't know how to like wash the walls I wipe spots off with a magic eraser but like I would love to get like a a good mop and like just literally wash the walls <laughs> at least in the living room and the places that people that aren't us see because <laughs> um it needs it there's fingerprints you know over jesse from over the years uh from us hanging up decorations just stuff like that you know but yeah it's just real bless you 
just realistic, I guess, you know. I just, it's not a museum. It doesn't have to stay perfect. Right? Yeah, anyways, I'm going to go get this video stuff ready and then record. And then I'm going to go clean the bathroom. We got to do that today, Sissy. We got to do that today. We got to do it. Hey, guys. Okay. I might just, I had some ground beef in the fridge. I'm limping, kids. I'm limping. <laughs> some, uh... Talk on me. I had ground beef in the refrigerator that needed to be cooked. That's what I was trying to say. But my brain is slow today. Or fast. I don't know. One of the two. <laughs> so, funny so how I just... it was funny. So I made taco meat for Devin to make tacos so he could take them to work. Wow. I can't film you because you're naked. <laughs> Jesse, it is so funny. He accidentally sat on a box and fell through the box and he got stuck. Stuck out of it. Yes. I was trying to. I was going to warn Daddy if he came. He dropped a leg on the toilet, and then he fell in the box, and I couldn't. I took a picture of it for us, you know, but I can't show you guys because he was practically naked in the underwear, as always. But uh, then I had to get the leg out of the toilet it's and then wash the Lego. I know it's comfy, but I can't ever show you in videos anymore because you're naked all the time. But anyways, I got the stuff here for chicken and dumplings. I just got to take the meat off the bone, which I'm going to do later when Debbie gets up so that I don't have chicken hands when the baby needs me uh i'm limping on my hip sometimes randomly it hasn't done it in a while I'm fixing my <laughs> leggings they're like rolling down anyways this hip my left hip on the inside it feels like it's right where like the leg and the hip connect um i don't know if it's arthritis or something but every now and then it just hurts really bad I haven't done it in months and when I first started, I thought it was something to do with giving birth because it was started around then. So I might have just messed something up. <laughs> this is how I found the box. So but it started hurting I, today. Hold on a minute. I, I it. it started hurting earlier. I could feel it like coming on and now it's making me limp and it hurts. <laughs> but usually it just lasts for a little while and then it goes away. So I don't know if it's arthritis maybe or if it's um, just from having a baby. Because <laughs> it first started right after I had June. Um, so I don't know if maybe she did something when she's coming out. Okay, okay, so I went to get the box so I could sit on. Uh-huh. So, but then... Then you fell on it. And then it started cracking the tape. Yeah, I heard the tape there. start cracking. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm stuck. Yep, you got stuck. He was hollering and I didn't realize that's what he meant. He said he was stuck. I thought he was just joking. You know, the way kids do. And... Um, I said, oh, well, I guess you have to stay there. <laughs> and then I didn't know he was actually stuck. So when I got up and I seen him, I started laughing. <laughs> it was so funny. I'll take a picture of it because I'm going to show Devin. I wish I could share it with y'all, but uh, he's in his draw underwear. Draw some clothes on there. I'm not going to draw clothes on you to show him. <laughs> just, you just got to start wearing clothes. <laughs> but anyways, I'm limping around the house waiting for June to wake up, and it's getting closer to time. We're going to wake Daddy up in about an hour. And then I'm going to make the chicken and dumplings. And then I'm going to try to sew. I, I need to sew. I haven't been sewing. <laughs> They're good. They're just biscuits that are uh, soupy. They're soupy biscuits. <laughs> but yeah, I just wanted to hop on here and say that what was fresh on my brain. And I'm going to go limp to the couch.